Hello, how are you guys doing today? I can't promise the length of this stream as I I didn't sleep that well last night, so I'm a little tired. Um, however, we have new merch in the group store. <laughs> For those of you who aren't in my Discord and maybe didn't see the community post, in the group store, we have new merch. <laughs> um, so that's how that's going. Happy Easter, by the way. Yes, we have Chubbins merch now. Hello, Jupiter. <laughs> You guys got jelly beans? <laughs> that was always my favorite Easter candy. Like I've always I've always been a sucker for jelly beans. Can I tell you something? Sure, what's up? Ate all my jelly beans. Aww. How do you like the event so far? Um It's okay. Like, do we want to put my- my count up? Hang on. Where is my recording text? We'll put my event count up as I catch them. Uh, text. It should be this one? Yeah. So I gotta- I think I caught one today. So I would imagine this is four now. <laughs> I still haven't caught a second Icy. Um, but that's okay. I need to clear part of my inventory. I've been running around with an almost full- well, with a full inventory for, um, the entirety of the event. I opened some, um, some inventory slots. I just have them filled so I don't have to keep- Worrying about the vault. So I'm gonna go get rid of some of those already. None of the events so far? Oh, I'm sure you'll get them. I'm just looking for the, uh, the Marwari. Nope, inventory's locked. Turn that off. There we go. Which one is your favorite out of the three? Probably the low tier. Yeah, I'm gonna say probably the low tier. Hang on, we're clearing up some inventory space. I've been using these horses as placeholders. We're using mass capture today. Don't know what island to visit, but we'll figure that out. Okay. <laughs> um, let me go through and look at chat, because I'm pretty sure I missed a few messages. Um, did you see what I said? Um, gotta scroll up from there. See somebody asking for my login streak? Sure. Here you go. There's my login streak. You're welcome. <laughs> Here you go. To the person who, I think it was like, um, uh, their name started with a W. Whoever asked for the login streak, there you go. <laughs> Hello, hello, welcome in. Did you see the pick of the IUH event appy? Yes, I did. The uh the cow print one. Pretty sure I saw the cow print one. New PNG tuber drops Wednesday. Uh Mel, I have some very bad news for you. I'm streaming every day of the event except tomorrow. So we might have the, um, the March PNG on Tuesday, then. <laughs> we might have to keep using the March one until Tuesday. 
Yeah. Wait, what are you doing on Tuesday? Oh, fair. Okay. Do you have any tips for new IUH hunters? Uh, I do have a tutorial on it. It's a video on my channel. Um, well, I could have swore I saw somebody have a screenshot of it. Here, I can go check if it's cow print or zebra. Pretty sure it was cow print. Oh, no, that one's zebra. Where's the cow print one? So that's a zebra one. I saw somebody post a cow print one on Royal. Hang on, I'm looking. Yeah, there's a cow print one and a zebra one. Somebody posted a, a zebra one and a cow print one. There's both. Both are a thing. Um, we will run this bottom to top. Um, hang on, hang on, hang on. Chat's moving fast today. Um. Oh, I just missed it. <laughs> oh, I found it, I found it. Do you prefer mass capture or run and refresh? Um, mass capture. Now, it doesn't really make a difference at all which one you do. Um, should I said No, I have not. On my side, it says, you asked if you could tell me something. Um, and then you asked me if I saw what you said. I didn't see anything else get said. It should be a tag for 10 to 10k. Aww. <laughs> it doesn't look like we're gonna hit 10k by our, um, our desired date. So I certainly hope that we can at least hit it, um, at least in April, I would hope, but, you know. Doesn't last how you age, a tech a diamond. Nope, my most recent one was on Wednesday. Her name is Moose, she's an amethyst, um, she's an amethyst fjord. Ugh. <sighs> Thought you had 9k? No, I've had, uh, I'm at 8.7k. Probably pretty close to 8.8, .8, but I, I've just been at 8.7. <laughs> I just really want the, um, I just really want the Marwari. Do you have the Diamond Tech A? I do. What do you stream on? Uh, I use OBS. I'm on my PC. It's it's a Windows one. I'm on Windows. I think the icy coat looks close to the clownfish coat. I don't, to be honest. They're very drastically different coats. Seen it now? Let me scroll. Uh, no, it's getting picked up by auto mod, so it's just automatically deleting your message. It doesn't even get held for review. Not even mods can see it. Is the catch of moose on stream? Yes, it is. Two screens or just one? I have two monitors. When I first started, I only had one, though. It's manageable. Alright, let me get my little lassos out. We've got 213. What's your favorite IUH? Uh, neon blue. They're my favorite. How many butterflies do you have? Probably like 30. I heard egg boppers. Yeah, there are egg boppers. Ew, I got a stat aura. <laughs> I don't like this stat aura that much. Well, there's one. There's one stat aura that I love. And it's the friendliness one. It's so cute. But I just can't make tech sets with most of the stat auras. Like, I could see maybe my racing horse having the speed one. Um, but even then, you have to make a tech set themed around it. And it just becomes a little bit of a hassle. 
How do you mass capture? You catch everything on a few islands you choose. I refuse to run just one island, but you can run quite a few if you feel the need to. Uh, I believe you get the island decor through, um, through the redemptions, and I don't know if Larry has any. <laughs> I have no idea. I haven't really done a lot of checking at Larry. I know he's got the new die. I bought some and I put it on a title. How many islands do you recommend? Um, if you are new... If you are- if you're newer to IUH or mass capture in general, I would- I would recommend like two, maybe three, uh, but I usually run around five. Like today, I'm running forest, I'm gonna run desert, mountain, and then probably lunar and jungle as well. Thank you for subscribing! Should probably make the event count smaller. Or we could put it right here. We'll put it down here. Yeah, we'll... What about right? No. Hmm. What, we'll just put it right here. It's okay. Event count is at the bottom of the screen. How long does it normally take for you to catch an IUH? Um... Any, the shortest amount of time was like 30, 30 seconds, because I found one when I got in one time, but the longest amount of time was five hours. As in like, constant, constant searching. It was five hours. Okay, I want to run Royal this time too. <laughs> We'll run whatever island I, I want to. Did we get a March IUH? Yes, we did! On Wednesday, we got Moose. Here, I'll just I'll show Moose on the screen real quick. This is Moosey Girl. She was, uh, she was born on Wednesday. I don't know, IUH is the Ruby Appy. Oh, you got a Pop-Tart! Yep, yeah, the streak is here. Next, we need to catch one for April. But the the March one was Moose. <sighs> now, are we just getting confused with Moose and Mouse? Listen, I've sadly called Moose. I called her Mouse the other day. I've called her Goose on accident. I've got a lot of fjords that are just, have either the, um, they just have the, the little S sound on the end of their name. Like, I've got Moose, Goose, Mouse, and a few others. Like, I've, I've, I've got a fjord collection. Name your third one Goose. I already have a Goose. He's not an IUH, he's a Rainbow Fjord, but I have one. Sorry guys, the chat's moving a little bit fast today, I'm trying to keep up. If I don't see your message, I'm sorry, I'll probably circle back to it, it's okay. We're also apparently running Royal today too. So I'm thinking Forest, Royal, Desert... Mountain and Lunar. That's our that's our selection today. What's your dream IUH? Um, to catch or just to own? Cause when it comes down to owning, I already have my dream. Like I have my dream one to just own, but I didn't catch it myself. Um, my dream to catch would be any event IUH or a white Frisian with pink cow print mane and tail. Yep, at the start of the event, butterflies would spawn on Royal, but they stopped them from spawning on Royal. Mm 
No usernames in chat, please. <gasps> May I ask you a question? Yeah, if you guys have any questions, just go ahead. Do you still have your pearly orange Frisian? I do! I do still have Cheddar Whale. She's thriving, don't worry. Taking great care of her. Hello, hello! Anything good? Not really. We're just doing the basic clearing of a few islands first. Do you think the Marwari looks like Storm from the Unicorn Academy? Um, no, I don't really see it. I think beyond both being purple, I don't- I don't really see it. So the V1 Clyde IUH? No, she was traded the day that I got her. I only had her in my inventory for about an hour. So she was traded like a year and some change ago. Happy Easter and everyone, if you celebrate, just join. Hello! How are you doing today? What do you think of this year's spring event? Um, I would have loved some 2024 bunny ears. I don't... At least I don't think there are any. Um, I, I don't know. <laughs> I'm loving the boppers. I haven't won any personally yet, but I'm loving the boppers. I saw them on somebody's, um... Saw them on somebody's horse. They posted it in media in my server and I just, I fell in love. <laughs> I'll win some boppers for some of my horses soon. Thank you for subscribing. What's your favorite holiday? Halloween. Halloween is my favorite. The fountain is not here this year. At least that's what I saw. Hang on. Let me go double check with Happy Acres. I'm pretty sure we didn't get the fountain this year. Um, Yeah, it says here, Note, the spring fountain will not be included in this year's spring event. All of the items that were only obtainable through the spring fountain last year are now obtainable through Luna's trade-in. The fountain is not functional this year. That's what it says in the, the update log. The fountain is not functional this year. Yeah, the model of the fountain is there, but it it says it says in the update log for the most recent update that it's not functional. <sighs> yeah, it's not functional. Not this year. Do you think life rings will return? Probably. They returned last year. They were in the fountain last year. So life wings will probably be back, I would assume. And the floppy bunny ears are unobtainable this year. They were they're year tagged, aren't they? So they were from last year. I think they're gonna make a 24 sun hat. I wish. <laughs> sun hats are my favorite accessory. Like, one of my favorites. If I had to pick the best event accessory, I would 100% pick the sun hats. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Sorry if I don't respond to all messages. I'm reading chat as quickly as I can. What's your favorite event horse apart from the title? Um, the Easter Egg Thoroughbred, followed by the V1 Val. There we go. Should I always hunt Lunar with my 100 lassos? I think about hunting Lunar. You should! Uh, if you use them only on Lunar, it should take about 10 clearings to use all of the lassos. What's your favorite breed? Thoroughbred. <laughs> my favorite breed is the Thoroughbred. Uh, 
Um, I saw a summer watermelon sun hat and it was to die for. Oh, I wish I was rich enough to trade for one of those. Assuming it was a V1. I haven't seen many non-default V2s. It's like a tip for IUH hunting because I haven't caught one yet. I do have a tutorial on my page, but I would say just be patient. Pick a few, a few islands and just run them. <laughs> Have you done the poll on Wild Horse Island yet about the breeds being added to the game? I have, yeah. I try to do every single poll in-game and in the Discord server as soon as they're put out. If you could make an event horse, what would it be and what coat? Um... Ooh, I don't know. I've never actually thought into designing any event coats. That's something I'll have to think on a little bit. Alright, mountain time. Oh yeah, I definitely want new islands. <laughs> new islands means an opportunity for new coats. And new breeds. There we go, we should be good to run this one. Any updates on the title, Petting Zoo? Um, no, not really. I haven't really got any. Um. I haven't got any new titles recently. I wish. I just haven't done any trading, and I obviously lately haven't been able to afford a title with my tokens. So I've been in and out of grinding tokens, and, um. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm kind of tired. A little out of it today. Hello, hello, welcome in. If you guys ever see any event IUHs and you want to, me to see them, um, you guys can always put them in the media channel in my server. I check that channel all the time. Don't even have to tag me. I check there every time I wake up. I see every screenshot you guys post to my Discord. Did Candy Hearts get dyed? Yes, he did! Uh, not around right now. He didn't get the dye now. I got them- he got them a couple- Is it a couple months ago when I got him? So, last month? I think? <laughs> Somewhere around there. Last month. There's a horse up there. I'll get it in a minute. Hello, hello! Who does your OC art? Mel. Mel does. She's one of my mods. You guys can find a link to her Kofi page in the description. There we go. Sorry, my chair is like leaning forward a little bit. The back of the chair isn't adjustable. So I have to keep adjusting the way that I'm sitting. Yeah, all of the little Pop-Tart horses people have posted. Come on. I want you to spawn a cute Pop-Tart or maybe a purple horse. I don't know. Ranch is so cute. Thank you. Hiding from everyone right now. So we have an Easter party. I don't want to see people. That's so valid. <laughs> I don't... Oh, I've never really attended a, a party really much. I've never... I don't even think my family hosts anything that allows our neighbors or our family friends to come over. Like, even at Thanksgiving and Christmas, it's just us. Ranch is fine. She's a tough lady. Yeah, I've also never been to an Easter party. Ranch is a tough lady. She's good. She can handle not having her little hooves picked. Just for a little bit. She's fine. 
Hello, hello, welcome in. Why? Oh, the playlist is just quiet. Yeah, tomorrow is the... Have you done an Easter egg hunt yet? No. Um, in real life, I have never done an Easter egg hunt. Any luck today? No, not really. We did just start. I've only been live for about half an hour. Um, all of the numbers you see down below are from privately hunting. So we're keeping track of everything I catch just down below right there. Favorite movie slash show? Um, no. <laughs> I actually don't. When I was a kid, I really liked the movie Titanic, but that's about it. Do you have any tips on getting an icy? Um, run Blizzard. If I remember correctly, that's where they have the highest chance of spawning. If you mean just like an icy in general, as in just the breed. Should I give my Pop-Tart Appies a name theme? You should. Listen, they're built like a Pop-Tart. I love them. <laughs> Ooh, nothing so far. I'm not clearing jungle today, so we're just running it normally. What's your favorite food? Lasagna. Nothing beats lasagna. How many butterflies do you have? Any tips on how to get them? I, I'll be honest, I've hardly been collecting them. I've probably got like maybe 30, 40, and that's it. Oh, you aren't supposed to open. I clicked on resources. Yeah, I've got 41. I haven't been collecting them. I haven't turned any in. I've been looking for the, the event codes more than anything because if I can find them in the wild, I really don't need to do the milestones. Sub two weeks ago and I already love your videos. Oh, thank you. That means a lot to hear. Yeah, I don't know. If I can find the coats in the wild, I don't need to do the turn-ins. So I'm just I'm just kinda here. You're like Garfield? Yeah. <laughs> I'll accept that. My PNG's a ginger. I'll take it, why not? I am currently not accepting gifts. Um, probable values, what's the value of like 100 moonstone? Well, most values are in moonstone, so it would be 100. <laughs> um, unless, you multi unless you want token value in which multiply by 373. <laughs> Need the tournament for the accessories? I know. But I mean, finishing the milestone would not be a priority if I got the Marwari in, um, just out in the wild. It wouldn't have to be a priority. Do you want to know something crazy? Always. Favorite event do you like in the spring event? Um, do you mean like my favorite spring event horse? Or just my favorite event horse of this specific spring event. Happy Easter to you too! I think my favorite spring horse overall... Hmm... Do I want to be like really nitpicky about this? Because I can. I could, I could be completely, mm. Cause if we, if we really want to be specific. Cause like technically, technically these aren't marked as spring horses. 
these are marked as Easter horses. So I could I could exclude them and say my favorite spring one was the Amethyst Thoroughbred. Um, but I think I'm going to pick this year's Marwari. Sorry, the Lavender Thoroughbred. My bad. <laughs> Same color. No difference. I just... I'm tired. Um, I've already gotten a Marwari, so I'm giving all of my luck to you. Thank you. Something for six hours earlier today, I, find no I found nothing. Me too, okay? Recording my video, the reason I posted it so late last night, I was looking from 3 p.m. to 9 p.m., okay? Six hours. And only just after six hours did I find the Icelandic. <laughs> six hours. Right at the end. I was about to give up, and that's when I found one Icelandic. That's when I found it. <laughs> I don't mind. Like, I really don't mind all that much. It's just... Oh, I wish I knew what I was getting into beforehand. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Um, I don't know about the breeding hub and the trading hub. I can check if you guys want to want to know what the most recent update log stuff says. Um, hang on, I'm looking. I'm looking. So they, they stopped them from spawning on Royal Island. They can spawn on Wild Island, according to that. Um, I don't see if anything else has been said. <laughs> don't see anything else regarding that, but that might have just been part of the most recent patch. Because they restarted the servers today at almost 11 a.m. Oh, my friend. I don't hunt with her. Okay. <laughs> Why? Where did the spoon fight come from? Do you like Spring Arabians or titles? I will always pick the title. I will absolutely always pick the title. Man, I don't know why this chair is so uncomfy today. Whatever. Can't tell you until it happens. Okay. Alright. You guys have fun with your spoons. I haven't seen you in so long. Well, I've been here. I've, I've been around. I'm just doing my own thing. Here we go. Hi, I'm new. Hello! Hopefully it doesn't break like the other one. Listen, this one's fine. It's just that the, um, the, the back of it, like the back of the chair is just, it's at like my, I don't want to, yeah, it's at like my waist. So it, it doesn't really go up as far as I would like it to, so it's a little uncomfy. Come on, let me catch you. <gasps> did I answer the shamrock shake question? <laughs> I don't remember if I did. I hope I did. If you could have an, another petting zoo, what event horse would it be? Um, I currently have three petting zoos. Um, my, my three are my main ones, my titles, that I've got one full of snowflake Clydes from the 2022 winter event, 
And then I have another one full of the V2 Vows from last year's Val event. Um, so those are the three petting zoos I currently have. So I think my newest one, if I had to pick, would probably be either the Marwaris from this event or the Arabians from the Val event this year. Yeah, that's my answer. There we go. How many IUHs do you have? I have 19. You like Murder Mystery 2? No, not really. Not because of the game. The game has been the same for years. Which, I guess that's also another reason I'm not a huge fan of it. But, for the people in it. <laughs> Every time I go into that game, there's people teaming constantly. There's people fighting. It's just not a cool game unless you're playing with friends. Do you have an IUH goal? Um, I would love to get to 20 that I've caught myself. I, I've caught a total of 13 IUHs myself, uh, but I've only kept 11 of them. So two of them have been traded away. So I think 20 that I've caught myself would be great. That should be my goal. I want to catch 20. Man, none of these horses have fancy coats or fancy hair. Do you have any mismatches? A couple. You have 19 IUHs? I do. I don't go out of my way to really collect them. I just kind of, I don't know, end up with them. <laughs> like, I think I've I've only traded for one. I I bought one. Um, 11 of the ones I have, I caught myself. Uh, and a few were gifts, like for Christmas. Do you like quarter horses or thoroughbreds? Thoroughbreds. Would you be happy if you got an IUH Arabian? Yes. But I should be very happy with that. It's a new IUH. Thank you. Catch some more where you should name it grape juice? Nah. Breeds and coats and mismatches do you have? Um... First one that comes to mind is my steel gray OG stat mismatch Arabian named Artemis. Um, I've got a training island unique mismatch. His name is Big Lots. I have... Ooh, are we talking about only bred ones? Because I, I do have a lot that are obtained. We're talking only bred ones that I have Baked Bean, I have Artemis... Baked Bean is just a basic Andy. Uh, that's just a mismatch. Of course, Artemis is mane and tail, black and white. Sorry for being late. Nah, you're good. <laughs> you are all good, don't worry. You're like V1s or IUHs? Um, yes, both of them. <laughs> I don't- I don't collect mismatches, though. I also don't- I guess you could say I go out of my way to collect V1s, so we're gonna pick that one. Do you have an IUH thoroughbred? No. I've never caught one. Is there such thing as a mismatch IUH? Uh, there used to be. There isn't now, but there used to be. Do you collect fjords? Not really. Hi, Nix. Is it harder to catch spring horses this year? Um, to be honest, I really don't know. I don't remember having a super easy time catching them last year. Is that a shamrock shake? Uh, no, it's a timrock shake. Copyright. <laughs> it's a timrock shake.
<laughs> no, the uh, the mismatch IUH, if I remember correctly, was undone and it was made non-mismatch. From what I heard, from what I heard. Um, have you got any pets? I do! I have a cat named Sparkles. She's so fluffy, so sweet, and adorable. Love your St. Patrick's outfit. Thank you! We get the, uh, we get the, the Easter slash spring themed one in a few days. Happy Easter. Thank you. Do you like Taylor Swift? Um, she's okay. I don't listen to any of her music. <laughs> um, so I guess I would say no, but like not in the sense that I hate her, in the sense that I don't listen to anything she puts out. <laughs> like I don't, I don't hate her, but I also don't listen to any of her music. Do you have a picture of my very fancy gentleman I posted in pets earlier? I did. I reacted to it. Can't find a hair tie. It's very hot in my room and I can't find a hair tie. Do you play ETG? No, I do not. I know what it is, but I've never played it. I can't find a hair tie. Oh. oh. Sorry, I'm trying to find one in my desk, maybe. Hang on, hang on. All right, I still can't find a hair tie. I can't find one. I don't know where they are. I'm giving up. I have I have given up. Do you play Rival Stars at least? Also, no. I'm not an equestrian, and to be honest, horses are also not one of my special interests. I mostly play this game for the collection aspect of it. Um... So, and a lot of games that revolve around horses aren't my thing. Alright. There's a herd on forest, so we're gonna work our way over there. Is my inventory hanging? Oh, yeah, we can stay on to add a few more. This is fine. This is okay. Come on. Is it possible to have three IUHs and a herd of three horses? I mean, if you are the luckiest person on Earth, probably. 
However, it's really unlikely when it really gets down to the numbers, but I, I could see it could happen. Like, I, it could happen, but you'd have to be really lucky. Sorry, I had to think on that one again. Hope you get an event. IUH, thank you. Is Nightbot a bot or a real person? Nightbot is a bot. That's why their name is Nightbot. In the future, will you still like titles? I've been liking titles since they came out. Um, and in June, it'll be... It'll be two years since they came out. So, uh, yeah. I, I would imagine so. <laughs> Alright, come on. You guys aren't gonna be colorful and cool. I don't want you on these islands. Come on. There we go. None of these horses are wearing event coats, and it's kind of sad. You know, I asked these horses to attend my costume party, and they didn't even show up in costume. We should really do a poll. <laughs> See how many event horses people think I'm gonna catch this stream. Do you want an event IUH? I think everybody wants an event IUH. Alright, royal time. Like I think I think everybody wants one. Do you like Arabians or Clydes? I would pick Arabians. How many butterflies do you have? Like 45. I think. 40-something. <laughs> we'll go with that. 40-something. What color of an IUH do you want? Um, I don't think I really have a preference. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. Come on, get in my backpack. Larry will absolutely adore you. What is your dream, IUH? A white Frisian with a pink cow print mane and tail. Oh, good. Finally, we can go ahead and tick that number up. Oh, wait, hang on. I want this lasso instead. Alright, let's go ahead and move that number up. It's now five. <laughs> 912 horses in your inventory? I know. If you get an IUH more you should name it Cough Drop. Nah. I, I don't think I I don't think I would. <sighs> Alright. There's our little count at the bottom. It's been updated. I don't know. When I think of cough drop, I think of like the really disgusting ones that have like the artificial grape flavor. And I I don't know. I, I don't even like grape candy. Listen, I've got a couple horses in my inventory. Did you catch Mulan? Yes, Mulan was my very first IUH that I ever caught. 
How much longer are you gonna be live? I have no idea. Really happy to just see you on stream. Aww. That's very sweet. I just like grape and orange flavored anything. I love orange flavored stuff. Like I love artificial orange. I like real orange flavor. Um, and I like actual grapes. I just hate the artificial tasting like grape candy, grape cough drops, uh, grape soda. I hate the soda especially. Can't stand it. This is fine. At the very least, I don't have a capture log to worry about like a lot of other people during this event. So I really only have to keep my eyes peeled for an IUH or an event. Everything else can be sold. Um, I don't have to look for any specific coats, any specific breeds. If it's, if it's a really weird color, it's coming home with me. Love watermelon and blueberries though. Ooh, God, I I buy watermelon every time I go to the store. Like anytime I visit Walmart, I get myself like a little box of watermelon for four dollars, and I just sit in the car and I eat it. All right. Alright, I have a dilemma. Should I run forest in addition to lunar and jungle? Or just run those two? Um, add forest. Forest is tiny. You playing? I'm playing. Um, I don't know yet. That hasn't really been anything I've I've been interested in quite yet. I know I've had a few friends send me some of the the videos that people have made um, regarding the development of it, but I really haven't seen a lot about it. It hasn't really piqued my interest. Think you'd ever do a face reveal? No. <laughs> no. Never. You guys will never see my face. Unless something really tragic happens to me and you guys see me, like, on the news. But beyond that, you guys will never see my face. <laughs> What's your favorite game? Um... I don't really... I guess I would say Wild Horse Islands. <laughs> um, when it comes down to it, I only play, um, when we see you and we, there's a lot of, there's a lot missing from that message. <laughs> Recognize your voice? Highly unlikely, because I live in such a, I live in an area with so little people that I don't think you guys would find me. I don't think there's- I don't think I have any viewers in my- in my general area of my state. Like, I probably have a lot of them in, like, the more populated- I've probably got a few, at least, in the more populated areas of my- of my state. Um, but I don't think I have any in my area, so unless I do a lot of traveling, it's unlikely you guys will, uh, ever run into me. <laughs> If you could add any breed to the game, what would it be? Uh, they just added my answer to that question. Like, I- before this, I had been answering Marwari the entire time, and now they're in- now they're in-game.
Are you friends with Lemon? Uh, we have each other added, but we're kind of acquaintances. We haven't talked enough to, like, really be like, oh, you know. Um. To be like, oh, you know, like, besties, friends. Like, I, I call Lemon bestie, but I also call everybody else bestie. <laughs> like, I see you guys in game and I greet you guys as, hi, besties, and stuff like that. I don't know, I kind of call everybody that. What state do you live in? I'm not telling you that. I'm also not telling you guys my name. Um. What video are you posting next? The next video will be on the 6th. And you'll have to wait to see it. Showing well her song a few days ago, you were so nice. Aww. Oh. Oh, your... Is your display name Tropics by any chance? Trading Hub, Ghost Frisian, with the Northern Lights fade hair, and the candle aura? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you actually, you might want to tune into my video on the 6th. I'm just letting you know. <laughs> you actually, you actually might, of all people, be the one who, who wants to look at that. Um. <laughs> I, I heavily encourage you on the 6th when the video comes out to watch that video. <laughs> How do you become a mod? You apply for moderator in the description. Um, it should say in big capital letters because I forgot to turn caps lock off that day. Mod applications. Applications get checked every Friday, though responses may be super late. As all of the admins and myself have been very, very busy lately. So even I haven't had a chance to look at mod apps. Do you celebrate Easter today? Um, my family doesn't really do anything for Easter. We sit around and do nothing, like, every Easter. Though I guess in some ways that is what you do on Easter. <laughs> like, we don't have any little kids in the house, so there's no Easter baskets. We don't really have any family in the area, so there's no one to really celebrate with. So there's no real, like, purpose to celebrating. Nobody dresses up. Nobody makes any special food. It's just another day to my family. <sighs> Let's get rid of some of these. Clear up some more space. What religion are you? Um, I feel like, I feel like that doesn't really affect my content, so I don't think I'm going to answer that one. So looking for a wooden western saddle pad. Uh, I think so? I haven't really... I, I haven't really had scented candle out many times lately. Just eating an Easter egg and going to a family meal occasionally. I don't think I've, I've actually celebrated Easter since 2018. <laughs> Thank you for subscribing! Happened to your money? I <laughs> I bought a title a couple weeks ago. What is your favorite horse in Wild Horse Island? My favorite horse is probably Trident, which is zodiac sign. Oh, that one's easy. I am a Gemini. I'm okay with you guys knowing my birthday because I'm I'm super cool like that. That, and it's really easy to find my birthday if you check any of my social media, so I just... <laughs> I don't mind anyone knowing my birthday. May or April? Um, Gemini doesn't start until end of May, by the way. Um... 
I just, I just, uh, it's, it's in May. <laughs> Ooh, what do you look like? Oh, you're not the event horse. So this is just a normal day for you? Yep, yeah, pretty much. Haven't really celebrated since 2018. Like, I, we used to go over to my aunt's house every time and celebrate there, but... Uh, she moved away a couple years ago, so we haven't done that. Number is the most recent title you got? Uh, 81 is what I currently have. Yes, I currently have 81. Do you have any horses with the same birthday as you? No, <laughs> sadly I don't. Um, for my birthday last year, I was out of town. And so I didn't play the, I didn't play Wild Horse Islands all day that day. Ow, one of my, one of my, like, legs is, like, kind of cramping a little, so I'm gonna stand up and walk around here for a second. So give me just a sec, because I don't like sitting for too long. My body doesn't like it. So I'm gonna, here, ranch dance for everybody. I'll still be answering questions, I just gotta stand up. Okay, we are standing. <laughs> What's your login streak? 528. Right? 528? Hang on, we can check. I got it today. 528. Yeah, I probably won't be doing a birthday stream on my birthday. Um, I'll be doing it either before or after my birthday. Does Title 81 have a name yet? Um, no it does not. Neither does Title 80. Sorry, I'm just standing up and walking around. I don't like sitting in one place. So no look on the more wire yet, I see. Yeah, still none. We've only found one event on this stream so far and I've been live for an hour. Ezra here, some different account. Hello! Hello, everyone. Just coming in. What's your group I want to join? It's called Tamaria's Rose Garden. You can find it in that command that Mel just posted, or you can find it in the description. Another really quick way to find it is to go to my Roblox profile and scroll down. It should be my primary group. When is your birthday? Ultra finding a horse with your birthday? May 21st. So, title trivia today. No. Title trivia is on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. You ever do another auction? Maybe. <laughs> Possibly. How's Kitchen Sink doing? She is absolutely killing it. She's doing great. Oh, almost fell. <laughs> I was leaning on my chair. Just a little bit. If you go... Anywhere for free, where would you go? California. So I can visit Xander. I would go to California to visit Xander. How's a microwave doing? I don't have one named microwave. <sighs> what should I name my pink heart blanket Arabian? Um... Hmm. Name it. Oh, name it after a gum brand. Any any gum brand that has like a really obnoxiously pink gum, name it after that one. Was Xander on stream when you caught moose? No, Xander doesn't join me on stream that often. But yeah, if I could go anywhere in the world, I would go see him. And then I would go see Lois. <laughs> Lois is all the way across the country from him, though, so... It's a little difficult to do both. <sighs> Alright, I'm sitting again. I just had to stand up, stretch my legs. Come on, ranch. 
What's your favorite animal? Red pandas, because they're the cutest little guys. I love them. Yeah, I don't know. I've got a I've got a lot of friends in different states. I would probably, if I could ever do it, make a trip to see all of them. My whole thing is though, I've never been on a plane. Um I've I've never been on a train. Um I've never even set foot in an airport. <laughs> I've I've never I've never been in an airport or on a plane. <laughs> I'm not scared of planes. It's, um, I'll put it this way. I am, for those of you who don't know, I am a plus size woman and it, it really comes down to, and like, cause I'm, I've been, a, I've been plus size like my entire life. I've always been like the chubby kid. Um, and even though I've been trying my hardest to, like, lose a lot of the weight, I still have anxiety around travel and stuff like that. Um, and so I just, I've never had an opportunity where I had to go on a plane. And because of that, I just, I don't know. <laughs> I never, I never took any of the opportunities. I don't know how accommodating it is. Like, I know a lot of planes are described as being, like, really kind of narrow. And if I end up sitting next to somebody and... Because, like, again, I've, I've always been, like, the, the chubby one. Um, if I end up sitting next to somebody and, like, I... <laughs> and, like, I take up too much room, I don't want their flight to be uncomfortable because of me. Like, cause that's, that's embarrassing, especially for me. So like, I've, I don't know. Hi, Beanie. Good morning. Everybody say hi to Beanie. We love Beanie. Beanie's actually somebody I know in person. <laughs> that's a Beanie. That's a bestie. We love Beanie. Yeah, I don't know. So I've just never really gone on a plane. Like, I'm not- I'm not ashamed of, like, being the- the plus-size kid, alright? <laughs> I'll own it. I look- at least- at the very least, I look great in sundresses, but I just- oh. <laughs> I don't know. I wouldn't want to ruin somebody else's flight experience. Now, if I could, I would buy myself two seats and, like, book the seat next to me. So I would have two seats to myself. <laughs> That's what I would do. I would book two seats. Right next to each other. That way, say I get like a window seat and then I, I book the middle seat. That way nobody sits in that middle seat because I paid for it so nobody should be sitting there. Easy. Easy. <laughs> What's your favorite song? Um I don't think I I have a favorite, but I can tell you what I've been listening to a lot lately. I've been listening to um I Kind of Relate by Drake Bell. I've been listening to that a lot. Yeah, exactly, Star. Like that's what I plan to do. And that's also why I, I don't know, I'm a little too broke for that at the moment. I wanted to tell you the spoon duel started, but I can't. Okay. <laughs> Absolutely love ranch. Thank you. Look at her. She's got her comfort bone. Mm -hmm. Ranch is our event runner. She runs all of the events. Take super chats? I don't mind super chats. Though I, I do also go out of my way to answer just every regular chat message as well. Do you like Taylor Swift? Um, no. 
And that's not like, oh, I hate to. No, I don't listen to Taylor's music. <laughs> I'm sure Taylor Swift is okay. I just don't listen to her music. I don't know. I tend to be a little picky with music. Yeah, exactly. Like, I don't... I don't hate her, but I don't listen to any of her stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just not a fan. <gasps> do you play Murder Mystery 2? No, I do not. I haven't played it in years. It's really only fun if you have a private server. And I don't want to pay for a private server because I'm I'm stingy. <laughs> I refuse to pay for a private server in a game where I don't have to. Now, for Wild Horse Islands, I'm on this game enough that having a private server and paying for it every month is something I find valuable. But for games that I, I don't even play at least once a week... Aww... Hang on, the notification's gonna go off in a minute. <laughs> Thank you, River! What's your favorite color? Red. <laughs> are my alerts okay, or are they delayed? No, this has scared me before. <laughs> my alerts have scared me before! Is this just delayed? I've had a I've had a little heart attack before from my alerts. That's okay. If it goes off, it goes off. But it was pink. No, no, no. My favorite color is red. Um and pink, but if I had to choose, I'd choose red. Are we holding on inventory? I can stand to grab more. Oh my god. Every time. Every time. <laughs> I just let my guard down. Come on. That's not... My heart just restarted just a little bit. It's fine. It's okay. I'm good. <laughs> no, because I'm like, yeah, I'm like, sure, it's gonna be late. It's always late. And then I'm like, oh, maybe it's just not gonna go off. I'll have to mess with my bot settings, like my little, my little alerts. Oh, that scared me. Every time. It happens every time. <laughs> Thank you, River. <laughs> yeah, I let my guard down, and then it happened. I gotta learn from my mistakes, but I'm really not. <laughs> yeah, never let your guard down. My alerts are always out to get you guys. <laughs> but the alerts are always gonna come after you and get ya. I think what's a little funnier is it's um it's a lot louder for me than it is for you guys. Like for you guys you might have heard like a little do 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 but like for me it's think of somebody like in a quiet library they pull out an air horn right next to you and they just pop it off. <laughs> like it, it's like that. What's your favorite season? Autumn. My favorite season is autumn because it's not hot, not cold. The snow hasn't arrived, but the summer heat is gone. So it's it's perfect. Um, the reason I prefer autumn over spring, because spring could be said the same about, is because in the spring there's a lot more mud, okay? In the spring, like, sure, we get all the flowers and we get, like, no, no incredible heat, but also the cold is kind of gone. No, because there's mud. 
everywhere. Because I live in an area where there's a ton of snow. Like, a ton of snow. What's your favorite cookie brand? Um... Ooh. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe, um... God, what is it? Is it... Is it Clover Valley? Yeah, it is. Okay. Clover Valley. Um, it's the... <laughs> it's the... It's the brand for Dollar Tree, Family Dollar, and, um... Uh, Dollar General. Because if you don't know, all three are kind of owned by the same company. Um, it's the, it's the generic brand for those three dollar stores, and they make off-brand Girl Scout cookies that are, that taste much better and are so much cheaper than the actual Girl Scout cookies. What's your favorite song? Um, I, I don't really have one at the moment. <laughs> Before stream, I had, um, I kind of relate on, just on loop. I really like the ballad of Jane Doe from Ride the Cyclone. Um, House of Asmodeus from Hell of a Boss is pretty cool. Um, maybe, maybe Two by Two from the Book of Mormon musical. I don't know. I'm I bounce around songs a lot. <laughs> cake or ice cream cake? Um, cake. Unless it's a Dairy Queen ice cream cake, in which sign me up, they make them so good. Yep, don't worry, I'm already hunting desert. My loop today is forest, royal, desert, mountain, and lunar. We're doing five islands. It's literally about to ask if you still like House of Asmodeus. I do. I do. Only only the cover, though. I don't like the actual one. Like, no no offense to the, the lovely... I believe... Well, I know one of them is a... <laughs> is a Broadway star. I don't know about the other one. But no offense to them. Okay, because no offense to the people who originally sang it, but I prefer all of the covers I've seen. The covers just make it flow so much nicer. How long have you streamed for? Uh, today, I've been live for an hour and 19 minutes. Don't worry, we already checked Volcano. I ran every island before I started mass capture. Yeah, Anna is the preferred one. I don't really like the original. I also don't like the original of Loser Baby from uh, Has Been Hotel. But I prefer the cover. A lot of the covers change some of the lyrics so they flow a lot better. And I, so I prefer the covers because I don't like the originals. No, come on, ranch. Come on, get up there. Good ranch. <laughs> they don't call her ranch dressing for nothing. There we go. <gasps> Mel doesn't really just come into my room during stream. She's in her own room. She's fine. If you can visit a petting zoo you haven't been to, what would you visit? I'd like to see an IUH petting zoo. Um, I... Well, no, no, no. It's it's not Keith's voice that I'm concerned about. Um, I didn't... I didn't like the part for, for Angel Dust. <laughs> and it's... It's just because of the lyrics of the song. Like, there were different ways to convey the same message without all of, like, the... They were, like, really quick stops. 
they just kind of ruin the flow of the song and a few of the covers have changed the lyrics in a way that make it that kind of puts it all together in a lot better fashion Like the song at the end when it, where it slows down and ends, it's like an abrupt stop. Like they just drop you like off a cliff or something. <laughs> it's too abrupt. Um, and so I've I've preferred the covers where they, they tone it down, they do a different instrumental, and it's it fits together a lot more and it's a lot enjoyable song. Hello, hello, welcome in. You like more Angel Dust or Husk? Husk. <laughs> What's your favorite drink? Um, I'm gonna say cream soda, um, or red Powerade. Oh, almost clicked that. There we go. Do you celebrate Easter? We used to. We don't really celebrate a lot much now. a v1 quarter horse i do i've got a couple um i have jupiter i have puddle and i have a no name so i got to watch hasman hotel yet i <laughs> i would say hasman hotel is pretty good but i would say the worst episode of it is arguably the first one I, I feel really bad for saying that, um, but arguably the, f the worst episode of Has Been Hotel is the first one. <laughs> Never heard you talk about cream soda before? Uh, it's been my favorite since I was a kid. I think when you and I first met, Beanie, um, I, I was still obsessing over Red Powerade. And started off well no it's i don't know if any of you guys have followed along with hasbin hotels production like all the updates they've given over the years that it's been in it's been in production there was one really big mistake that they they put in their their little like sneak peek at episode one that in the final version of it they left it in and it just i can't unsee it and on top of that, it's there's if you are bad with secondhand embarrassment, I would I would have the pause button ready at all times. Like I think Hasbun Hotel is one of the one of the few shows where I've just in episode one I've experienced enough secondhand embarrassment to make me have to walk away for a second. So if you if you struggle with secondhand embarrassment in shows, have the pause button ready. <laughs> Hello, Sapphire. Welcome in. Other than that, I think Hasbun Hotel is a decent show. I prefer Hell of a Boss, but that's just because it's a lot... Um, it's... There's a lot more to it, okay? So there hasn't been enough. Not enough. There hasn't been... No, we'll use the word enough. There hasn't been enough of Hasbun Hotel released for me to be like, Oh, I prefer one or the other. I'm gonna watch both of them. I enjoy both of them, but as it stands right now, I am I am so loyal to Hell of a Boss. It's unbelievable. Nah, see, you get it. You get it. <laughs> when when something happens, like I don't know if any of you guys have seen Better Call Saul. Um, if you guys have seen Better Call Saul, it's it's what Xander and I are currently watching in our free time. And we are, we are on season three, I believe, or we might have just finished season three. I don't remember. Um, but we, we're around there, and there are so many moments in Better Call Saul where either myself or Xander has had to pause and take a minute to just calm down. Like, the one where he self-sabotages himself, not once, but twice, in front of a packed room of elderly people. Okay, this man sabotages himself twice in a room full of people and I can't do it because one of these scenes is five minutes long and it's it's Saul, okay? It's it's him talking about a crime he got arrested for and like charged for 
in front of a group of potential clients for his his lawyer business, okay? Because he was an elder law at that point. And it's a five minute long clip. And and he's he's telling all of these clients the stuff that he's been arrested for because he's having a he just found out like something big in the plot and he's like ha going through it. Okay, he's having a little bit of a crisis. And the scene goes on for like five and a half minutes and we had to pause a total of like four times just to stop that scene from continuing before we could keep watching it. <laughs> it's a great show. <laughs> it's a great show, but... Oh my god, I've never cringed so hard. What are you talking about? We're talking about Better Call Saul and secondhand embarrassment in TV shows. <laughs> where they we're talking about TV shows with really bad secondhand embarrassment. Like it's uh if you don't know what secondhand embarrassment is cuz I realize I I had a few people ask this last time this topic came up. Secondhand embarrassment is when you watch a character or even somebody you know like in real life or anybody. It's when you watch somebody else embarrass themselves and you are embarrassed for them. Um, so, like, say, you know what, just exactly that. Scenes in TV shows where you, <laughs> where you have to look away or you feel embarrassed just by watching the character embarrass themselves, that is secondhand embarrassment. And there are so many shows that take advantage of that, and it's so good, but I can't watch those shows. <laughs> do you own any springies? I do! I currently have three. Found five of the appies. I have... Only one in today's stream. We have found one singular event horse and I've been live for about an hour and a half. Let's fix it on has been for a good month and it's torture because oh dear god the fandom's so immature. I know. You would think for a, a, a show directed at an, a more adult audience it wouldn't, it wouldn't be like that but to be honest most more mature leaning shows have a an audience of just children. And that's not necessarily a good thing, but that's how it ends up happening. Like look at the amazing digital circus. I'm sure the 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 little one singular episode itself is perfectly fine. I've seen a lot of it, but the fandom was already taken over by just a bunch of a bunch of kids that Kind of ruin the experience when it comes to the fandom. Like, I, I can't see that show gaining a meaningful fandom after <laughs> after how well it did on kids' YouTube. <laughs> I can't I can't see it gaining a meaningful following after that, but it was it was decently made, it was well animated. Um but it's stuff like that. Or the South Park craze. Uh, South Park is geared towards an adult or I would say an older teen to an, an older adult audience. Um, and a lot of younger audiences got a hold of it like last year or the year before. And it, it pretty much went through the same treatment that a lot of, a lot of shows and games go through. Like, I, I was 100% part of the cringe, quote-unquote cringe fandom for Five Nights at Freddy's as a kid. Like, Five Nights at Freddy's in 2014, when it came out, was I obsessed with it just like every other kid? Yes, I was. Like, no matter what series comes out, no matter what the topic of a game, especially horror games, by the way, no matter what topic of a game, show, or whatever, if it becomes popular with kids, um... It's, it's gonna be like that. Like, I was... <laughs> I was, um... I was a FNAF kid. I was a creepypasta kid. Like, I had I had my, my chance to go through that phase. Yeah, yeah, Poppy Playtime is a really good example of that. And it's it's just gonna keep going. Like, it's it's a phase that you... Everybody goes through at some point in their life. And I, I'm not gonna blame them. But it also does make fandoms a little insufferable if you are on the older side. Like, I'm sure, <laughs> I'm sure I would have been, if, if we had as much, like, 
posting about cringe stuff as we do now. Um, I'm I'm sure I would have made it into a few compilations as a kid. What's the best tip for catching IUHs? Um, I would say have a lot of lassos, take breaks when you need them, and just pick an island and go. <laughs> the way in which you IUH hunt doesn't have a serious, like, huge impact. Um, I prefer to mass capture because I need tokens. But running and refreshing, if you have a private server, is also very good. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love South Park. I've loved it for a very long time. Um, but I still remember the craze. Like, people started making fan art uh, about it. And these were young kids, by the way, making fan art about it. Giving giving them like different identities and stuff like that. And that's that's awesome. I love the creativity on it But I just every every fandom eventually goes through that period and I I am so proud to say I got out <laughs> I got I got out of that fandom craze Like I am I am no longer the cringy five nights at Freddy's kid That I used to be and I'm so proud of myself for that I do still love Five Nights at Freddy's, by the way. It's still one of my favorite franchises. You are you age hunting? No, we're event hunting. I just... <laughs> I don't mind whatever I find. I found hardly any event horses. There's a pot of gold. I know, don't worry, I saw it. <sighs> never got into the South Park. I've never watched it. Um, it's got like 20, anywhere from 25 to 26, maybe 27 seasons. I think 26. I watched season 26. So, I, at the very least, they don't really follow a specific, <laughs> specific timeline. Uh, so I would suggest you can start South Park just by looking up what's considered the best episodes and then just jumping around if you really want to. I know, I remember the first episode, it was great. I, I don't think I was... Um, I don't think I was very old when my mom showed me it. How many pots of gold do you have? Um, here, let me catch this horse real quick and I'll look. I don't think I have any. I know there's one sitting over there on the beach, down that way. What if you find an IUH event? What would be your reaction? Um... I don't know. I've had a large, like, varying selection of reactions. Not selection. That sounds bad. <laughs> um, I've had a I've had a large variety of reactions to catching IUHs. Uh, when I caught my amethyst, uh, fjord just a uh, just a couple days ago, I didn't really react. I said, "Oh my god!" and then I caught it. <laughs> And then I was like, all right, a personality and gender swap for you. And then that was it. <laughs> like, when I caught this lovely lady, didn't really have much of a reaction. How many tidal waves do you have? Uh, currently 81. All right, name ideas. Um, is it a, is it a mare or a stallion? If it's a if it's a stallion, go with Lord Nightshade. <laughs> Just for my peace of mind. Just got disconnected and I was about to get my dream horse and they accepted too. Oh. Amar, why he's a mare? Uh I still go with Lord Nightshade. <laughs> I think Lord Nightshade's a good name. Yep, gender swap potions were originally chest exclusives, um, but they added them to the to the Robux shop after a while. Lord Nightshade it is, thank you. If you want to know who Lord Nightshade is, you can look him up. He's a boss from Wizard101. <clears throat> Um, who introduced you to Wild Horse Islands, or did you find the game yourself? Mel introduced me. 
A few days after she started, she begged me to play. And you know what? I finally gave in. I saw her online. I was like, hey, I'll play this game. Now here I am. Here I am almost two years later. What do you think of the Marwaris? I love them! Once you started playing... Wait, hang on, Beanie. Repeat. <laughs> Ooh, butterfly. Yeah, the person selling it for 325k... Ooh, that's wild. That is insane. You wouldn't leave it for days? Yeah. What do you think about the tech A's? Um, I've got a couple. <laughs> I'll leave it at that. I've got a couple. Here we go. We'll go ahead and sell 39 again. I just joined. Hello, welcome in. Yeah, I've got a diamond encrusted one. To the person asking the question about the Marwaris, I already answered. Please stop spamming the question. I'm gonna do a turning in butterflies video? I probably should. Because <laughs> I don't think I'm really going to work on the, um, I'm really going to work on the milestone rewards. So I think towards the end of the event, I'll probably just do a video turning all of my butterflies in. Hello, hello. Go ahead and buy 300 lassos again. So there's that for rope. Two and three, that's one hundred. One, two, and three, that's two hundred. One, two, and three. Should be enough for three hundred. How many butterflies do you have? I actually don't know. One hundred. Two hundred and... 300. Yay! Lower the spotting of the butterfly or something? I actually don't know. What's your favorite event horse you have? Probably Trident, my title. What's your favorite island? Desert. I love desert. Alright, I'm gonna take a moment to stand again. So you guys feel free to ask whatever question you want in chat. Um, we'll let Ranch dance right here so I can take a moment to stand up, get the circulation in my legs going. <laughs> Alright, I am standing. <laughs> Ask whatever you want. How long will you stream? Um... I'll be- I'm live usually until I get bored, to be honest. Can you boop ranch? Uh... I can kiss her on the nose and- You guys go- you guys get- get ranch view. Um, let's see. Hello, hello, welcome in. <clears throat> if you could have one IUH to each island, what would they be? Um, to forest, I would add wood. To jungle, I would add jungle wood. Um, to mountain, I would add stone. Just basic stone. Um, copper would go to blizzard, because we're, we're covering some little, little things that I feel like should already be there. Um... To Volcano, I would say more volcanic colors. No specific ones in mind, but just more volcanic colors. 
Um, is Ranch OG? Nah, she's not. She's got OG um, stamina, though. <sighs> what will you name the Marwari if you get it? Um, ooh. I haven't thought about that one yet. To be honest, I haven't even named most of my um, Valorabians from last month. That's a really good question. I like that one. <laughs> I feel like I'd love to see somebody name it Grimace, though. What's your favorite horse in your inventory? Um... Trident, provided she's still in my inventory right now. I can't remember if I put her in my barn or if she's in my inventory, but... Trident. How are you guys enjoying your ranch content while I stand up and stretch? Today I saw someone with a wild caught purple marwari. Ooh! Me next. I want one. What do you think about the spring event? Um. I like it so far. I, it's a little bit more grindy. I think I would put it on the same amount as the summer event of last year. Where I, I don't think I'm gonna I'm gonna catch that many of the Marwari this time. But it is only day two. I've got time. Can you cuddle Sparky for me? I will. I'll tell Sparky you said hi next time. What are UH colors you still need? Um, to catch, I need all of the ones on Forest. I've never caught one on Forest. Um, I don't need any of the lunar ones. I've caught all of the lunar ones. Who's your idol? Markiplier. <laughs> Markiplier is by far the content creator I look up to most. And you know what? <laughs> if he says he could have been an engineer, I could I could be an engineer. And that's actually the career path I want to take. I don't know. Something about, about Markiplier has always been like my... It's always- he's always been kind of an inspiration in some way or another. Even when I went through periods of, like, not watching Mark's content, I've- I've always kind of seen that guy as, like, somebody to look up to. So I think- I think my answer ultimately has to be Markiplier. Just gotta grab some butterflies. We've got a whole lot of them over here. Hello, let me just sneak up on you guys. Got any more down here? They always group together on this hill every time, every year. Alright, I got 75 butterflies now. Should I turn in my butterflies at 1k or get 1800? 1800. 1800. Oh, I hit a tree. I also see a butterfly right here. Yay! And one right there. Come here. There we go. What's your favorite horse breed? Probably thoroughbreds, because fast. <laughs> in real life and in game, thoroughbreds are my favorite. I can appreciate a very fast horse. Come on, let me catch you. There we go. And I'll take these butterflies in exchange. Do you have horses in real life? No, they're too expensive. They're like, um, living, breathing vases. Okay? You know how, like, just something small happens and the vase, like, shatters? Yeah, that's- that's what a horse is. They're so expensive, but they're so fragile. I don't have the money to properly care for one. 
one thing happens and I'm I'm in bankruptcy. <laughs> Horses are just, yeah, they're super accident prone. They're like built like a vase. They are the vase of animals. <laughs> and I, I, I cannot afford those, those bills. I, mm. like I would, I would do anything for my animals. Um, like my, my animals, I make sure, especially my cats. Cause I've got cats. Um, I make sure my animals are fed, taken well, well care, like, really good care of. Stuff like that. But if I had a horse, oh, I would be bankrupt. <laughs> um, if you did horse riding IRL, what would you do? I don't know. I don't actually know them. You stone horses, those vet bills? Exactly. Like, I think my quickest way I could ever go bankrupt is to get a horse. <laughs> um... Get the rainbow fade hair. Ooh, did someone? Oh, they did! Thank you for subscribing! Uh, Larry, I already sold some stuff to you. <laughs> Buying a horse and seeing how fast I go bankrupt. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Alright. Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. We're going up. That means it's royal time. What was your dream horse when you started playing Wild Horse Islands? Uh, V1 Val, actually. I feel like that's a pretty standard... Um... Like a, a pretty standard dream horse for a lot of the a lot of the longer time players and even a lot of the newer ones. Um my dream horse was a V1 Val. And I was I remember I was so happy when I got apple juice that day. How many horses do you have in Wild Horse Islands? Um. Ooh. I think. Are we are we counting the horses I've just caught? Cause right now I'm carrying around eight hundred and seventy five. <laughs> Dream Horse has always been an infernal V1 Frisian. Yeah, me too. My current Dream Horses are a pure Wildcat title and a V1 infernal Frisian. Both of which are like crazy expensive. Thank you for streaming. Aw, thank you for being here. Also, on the 6th, I really do suggest you, um... You take a look at that video. I think you of all people is going to want to see it. There we go. Do you want a thoroughbred are you itch? Yeah, I would love to catch one. <laughs> What's your favorite horse other than Trident? Um, I think I would say... Ooh... You're so sweet and kind. Thank you. That means a lot. I think I, I would pick Apple Juice, followed by Mulan, followed by Cruella. No more yet? No. Have you, Tango? You caught one yet? <laughs> I'm hoping for a day two one. I'm gonna be very upset if... When I go to record the giving away every rare horse I catch video and it comes up and it's my first one, I will be so upset. I'd still give it away because that's the rules of the video, but I would be so upset.
Like I would I would be incredibly upset. <laughs> I'd find your server and take it. Tango, I feel like I would be less upset with that, but <laughs> somehow one of my friends always ends up sneaking into the video. This is fine. This is okay. Tango, I just want you to know I've been live for almost two hours and I found one singular horse. One singular event horse and it was the Appaloosa. Like, that's it. <laughs> this event count down at the bottom of my screen is the total count of events the last yesterday and today. Yeah, I've been live for two hours. Almost two. Um, and I've only found one singular event horse the whole time. Did you get any high tier rainbow horses? No. Um, I got mid tiers and low tiers, but that's also because I didn't run the race. Like the few times I did run the race, <clears throat> I, I did it until I got one horse and then I stopped running. I didn't put much work into running the race. God, I'm gonna cry if I get an IUH before I get this, this silly little Marwari. I just got a Sapphire Fjord in my server. Oh. Either somebody outside has a really noisy car, or they have their lawnmower out. And regardless, it is too early for a lawnmower. It's not even April yet. Put your lawnmower away. Oh, I can't speak today. How many IUHs do you have? I currently have 19. Poofles or Aloha, then I will get bingo. Um I don't I don't know about either of them. I'm pretty sure both of them are busy. <laughs> I'm I'm pretty sure both Poofles and Aloha are busy. I don't think you're going to see them today. And I know, I know Toby isn't home, so you're not going to see Toby. How many mods showed up today? Um, we've had... Didn't have Akira today, so no Akira. We've had Mel, we've had Beanie, our lovely admin. We love Beanie. Uh, and we have, we've had you... Uh, Lois hasn't been in chat today. Poofles has not. Xander has not. Um. Trying to think. So, like, I, I don't think the bingo is gonna be completed. Because it is a holiday, so... Akira was not here. Akira has not been here today. Um, in fact, Akira hasn't really been to the last couple streams. So the Neon Purple Clyde? No, I traded that um, a year and some change ago. Oh yeah, Happy Easter, Tango! How many spring butterflies should I get? Get 10,000. No, sorry, that's- that feels like a really mean goal. Get, um, get 2,000. There you go. And then do it four more times. <laughs> What's your favorite Feverful you have right now? Um, Spearmint. She's my- she's one of my Feverful titles. Followed by Giwi, because we love Giwi. Bye, Autumn. Thank you for being here.
Alright. <laughs> Which strat do you use for IUH hunting? I, I do mass clearing. Yeah. Uh, I didn't even- I've never really gone to the, the trading or the breeding hub to look. I really wish I had when it was still an option. There we go. Right in my day when I'm sad. Aww. I should really go get that herd. It's been there a while. That's fine. I'll get it later. Hi, Lainey. Hello. Okay, this is fine. There we go. I don't know, I'm getting kind of tired. I don't know how much longer I'll be live. There's no title trivia or anything today. Um, because that is a Monday, Wednesday, Friday thing. So we don't really have to do title trivia or anything today. So I don't know how much longer I'm going to be live. Hello, hello, welcome in. Hello and happy Easter. Thank you. Happy Easter to you too. I don't know if they've been removed from the trading and breeding hubs. That's just what everyone's saying. There's just a lot of people saying that they were. Come on, get in my backpack. Come on. There we go. Okay, we're good. Right, there isn't... Okay. Uh, yeah, there were butterflies on the breeding and trading hubs. I don't know how long. I know that there were videos made about it as well. And I've been seeing a lot of people reporting that they're not there anymore. They should still be on Wild Island, though. If you guys go to a private server and run that. At least I think they should still be on Wild Island. The update log says they are. Would you stream me and Mel's spoon duel? Probably not. Just cause that, that would require me um, to be there and to be honest, I'm usually really busy when I'm not streaming. So I don't know if I'd have time for that. They aren't in the breeding hub anymore. Aww. Uh, Tango, I think I think I saw people talking about a lot of them spawning on the the trading and breeding hubs. So it might have been done so that you don't get it too quickly. Like I think, let me let me check. Oh yeah yeah yeah, even Nick's DM me it was like use the breeding hub for butterflies. I got 800 in the last hour. Yeah, so I think I think it, it easily could have been either they weren't supposed to be on there or they were spawning too quickly. Uh, 
Oh, yeah, yeah, I get all of mine on forest. I really wish they still would have spawned on royal. I feel like them spawning on royal would have still been a good, very good idea, but... I, I trust the devs in their decision. Would have no-lifed it? Yeah, me too. <laughs> 100%. This is fine. There we go. You're my idol out of everyone. Aww. That's so sweet. All right, lunar time. I'm kind of like screaming and crying. I'm a little I'm a little demotivated. It's been 2 hours and only one event horse the entire time. Like the motivation's just not kicking in. <laughs> How's Alien? Alien is doing so good. He's being a he's being a cute little guy. Alien started his first TikTok. He was in the um your birth month, your IUH. He he did a great job. <laughs> he was in his very first TikTok. Go event hunt and say I'll find him our way before you, you'll find one no problem. There are people, okay, I I have seen a few people who already have, like, three wild-caught ones. Okay? It's day two. Why do some of these people have three? <laughs> I'm, I'm trying my best. I gotta keep up. Yeah, he was the horse for March. He did a great job. I love him. He's great. Yeah, there are some people who have already caught three. Alright. There are there are a few people, because I lurk in media, like media channels, not only in my own server, but in other Wild Horse Island servers. Um, because you know, my server is not themed around Wild Horse Islands, but we do have a trading channel for it. Um And I, I lurk and I just see these people catching and catching and catching, and I'm just like, alright. This is <laughs> When is it my turn? <laughs> when do I get to catch one? So I'm just I'm just kind of going through. I am, as I said, losing a little bit of motivation. Um, but I'll I'll power through it. I got this. If I have to, I'll just record a TikTok or something to to get a little break. <laughs> I mean, I feel like I could be an older sibling to some of you. There are a few of you- there are a few people in chat who are older than me, but... <laughs> I feel like with my age, I would fall in that category. What's your favorite V1 quarter horse you have? Jupiter. My girl, Jupiter. Jupiter was my first horse I caught on this game. She's from Tutorial Island. She's she's a cutie patootie. Um, and I love her. Better get a pure wildcat title, you get it. Oh, that's very sweet. Why don't you refresh your server and see your luck? Alright, we'll fill my inventory with horses. So we'll just catch until my inventory's full. Um, which is a little bit. <laughs> um, yeah, this is fine. We'll catch until my inventory is full, and then I'll refresh my server. This 
This is fine. This is okay. Do you know when the spring event ends? I... I actually don't know. Hello, hello! Welcome in! What's your favorite event in Wild Horse Islands? Um... The Halloween event overall, but my favorite event that's ever happened was uh, summer of 2022. There we go. I was adjusting the way I was sitting. Paper bag is so amazing. Wait, what is named paper bag? What kind of horse is it? I missed it. I didn't get to see it. Sorry, I didn't get to read it. Anything with the spring accessories? I think they're okay. I haven't really seen a lot of them. I still have most of mine from last year. Okay. Down to forest. How do you feel about the more in-depth stuff Trick posted about the new server setup for the island? I'm... Mm, I like it. <laughs> I like a lot of the decisions that um, the devs have been making. Like, I know the overhaul or the, the, the separation, you know, the upgrades they've been talking about. I know I've, I've very been... I'm... <laughs> Words. I've been very excited for them. Come on, pull out the lasso. Would you vote on for the next breed? The one that started with a... Did it start with a C, I think? The, the one that looked like a cutie patootie. Like the next cutie patootie that I should be rooting for. <laughs> I'll go, I'll go show you in a minute. Just, if you look at them right now, Tango, and you look at one and you go, Tem would call that a cutie patootie, I probably voted for it. <laughs> like, if you could look at an animal and think I would call it cute, I probably picked it. I know which one you want. Yeah. Yeah, that one. Beep. There we go. Collecting butterflies as I run. Yeah, 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 that one. It looks like, um, I think I called it a Tootsie Roll. You know, I, I'm not even excited to see this Appaloosa. <laughs> Alright. We'll mark that up again. Same spot as the last one, though. Up. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I like to pop out of nowhere in my Discord server. What's the biggest mistake you've made on Wild Horse Islands? Um, trading a V1 IUH Clyde. That, I would say that's the biggest mistake. Hi, Xander! There you go, guys. That's the Xander I was talking about earlier. For anyone wondering, that's the one. Show haunts? Okay. Can do. <laughs> Hi, Xander. How are you doing? <laughs> Here's Hans. He brought you an apple. Here, let's get some butterflies with him. There we go. He runs a publishing company, you know? Yes, yes he does. 
We love horses that run publishing companies. If your horse isn't run running a publishing company, what is your horse doing? Alright. Tired. Aww. Uh, butterflies! Don't mind if I- oh, I missed. <laughs> Don't mind if I do! Any luck recently? No, we just got Appaloosa number 6, which means two events in two hours and twelve minutes. <laughs> like, that's- um, I don't think I'd exactly call that very good. <sighs> What's the rarest horse you have right now? Um... If we use this, it's gonna say it's one of my Percherons. Or not, it's gonna say it's Garland. Um, but in my opinion, I would say either Apple Juice. Um, or maybe Cheddar Whale. Maybe Malt, or... Where is she? Or Blue Duck Plate. What do you have to say? Me spending 500k in total to catch, buy, and make Forever Foals. Ooh! I think that's a good idea. That's pretty cool. Why are you kidnapping butterflies? Because I can. Why aren't you? <sighs> it's event season, Xander! You remember event season from uh, last month? It's event season. <sighs> Alright, let's get Ranch back out. Those butterflies, they're fine. They're going to somebody who likes butterflies. The butterflies are staying with their families. It's okay. <laughs> I love your videos. You're so cool. Thank you. Yeah, exactly. I get the families too. The butterflies are fine. Um, Nyx, I don't know what that is. Well, I know what that is, but we don't have them in my area. <laughs> like, we don't- we don't have that in my area. No, Ranch, why did you sliding stop? I didn't hold the button, I pressed it! Come on, Ranch. Yeah, we don't- we don't have that in my area. Hi, Sophie! Try them whenever you're near one. I- I will. I've never been near one, but I will. Don't worry. You know what I'm craving? I want Subway cookies. How are you doing, Sophie? It's been a while, it has. Welcome back, Spidey! What's the horse everyone wants that you have? Um... I don't know. I feel like any horse that I show, it could be easily countered with Oh, well, I'm not this kind of collector, so I don't want that. Um, so I feel like... I feel like I don't really have an answer to that one. Imagine if you get the Marwari or whatever it's called with an IUH hair. I wish. <laughs> but right now I'd be lucky just to get one. With or without special hair, I'd be lucky just to get one. 
Can I see blue duct plate? Yes, you can. Give me just a moment. <sighs> Why don't you play in a public server? Because it's event season. I prefer hunting in a private server so I can mass capture. With your luck, you might get one. I, I hope so. <laughs> but I'd love just a regular one as well. I have returned. Welcome back. There we go. This is fine. Any name ideas for... Of the Appy Stallion. Um, Toaster. There you go. Name it Toaster. Right now, we're just catching to fill my inventory at this point. I'm standing up real quick to fix my chair. Give me a second. Okay, I'm back. We're good. <clears throat> I am getting kind of tired. Um, how much more do we have to catch? Welcome back. Thank you. Are you age values going down? Yes, they are. They are, they are slowly dropping as more and more get caught. Um, Alright, let's do the rest of the route. I'm also overheating quite a bit. It's kind of hot here today. Or at least it's hot in my house, so I'm overheating a little. What's your dream IUH right now? Um... You know what? You are better than nothing. Come here. Come on. Like you've been live for uh two almost two and a half hours. Here we go. We can check this up to two now. Now we have two of them. <laughs> oh, it's clingy. That's kind of cute. Okay, space bar, please work. There we go. Should I make paper bags, halter, priz, or moonstone? Priz. Prismatic all the way. Why is it so hot in my room? This is fine. It's okay. This is- this is fine. I'm surviving. 
What is your favorite horse game that's not Wild Horse Islands? Um... I, this is really the only horse game I play, so we're just gonna say Horse Life, even though I've only played it a few times. <laughs> I don't really play a lot of horse games, so I don't really have many favorites. Do you play Star Stable? No, I don't really like that game. What's your dream pet in real life? I have my- I have the pet that I've always wanted. Ever since I was little, I would tell my mom that I wanted a, a white cat with big blue eyes. And you know what? I got her. I've got Sparky. I already- I already have my baby that I've always wanted. And it's even better because she is a flame point Siamese, and that is my favorite coat on a cat. Um, so she was literally my dream cat to ever have to ever have. She's my baby and I love her. She's super cuddly. She's super sweet. She'll she'll walk right up to me and just like sit with me. She's a little cuddle bug and I love her. She goes out of her way to come into my room as well. She, um, I call it knocking, but she'll like lightly scratch at the door, wait for me to answer. And if I don't, if I don't answer it, uh, she'll do it again. She does it until I, I bring her into my bedroom and let her lay on my bed. <laughs> she just knocks on my door. She's just a little baby. She's so polite. Mom says hi and happy Easter to you and Mel. Aw. Hello, Mother Sophie. Everybody's moms gets that name. Like, Beanie's mom is uh, Mother Beanie. <laughs> Poofle's mom is Mother Poofle's. Um, Sophie's mom is Mother Sophie. <laughs> Everybody's mother gets a nickname that looks like that one. Like, I know, um... I I don't call Lois's mom like that, though. Like, Lois's mom is not Mother Skelefairy. Lois's mom is just Lois's mom. <laughs> I love Lois's mom. She's so sweet. She's so nice, and she told me she loves me, too. I love Lois's mom. <sighs> hello, hello! Welcome in! If you could bring back one V1 horse in Wild Horse Island for a week, which one would it be? The V1 paint horse. That's what I would pick. The V1 paint horse. Oh, yeah, I told Beanie's mom that I loved her, and Beanie's mom froze and didn't know what to say. <laughs> like, kind of valid. I get it. Um, but, I don't know. I, I love my friend's parents. No, the reason I wouldn't bring back the V1 Frisian or the V1 Clyde is because it would absolutely destroy their value. Whereas, like, if I if I absolutely had to pick, it would be the paint horse. Cause let's be honest, if there's if there's a V1 that um or I could pick the quarter horse, maybe. I don't know. I would pick either the paint horse or the quarter horse. Well, 
What's your favorite meme? Um... Time the horse hunt and find a Mawari before you? Not on my watch. <laughs> Tango, you remember what you said last month? <laughs> you you remember you remember what you said last month, right? I'll do it again, Tango. I'll do it again. <laughs> I'll 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 do it. Don't test me. What's your favorite fruit? Um either banana, strawberry, or um, orange. I just finished running desert, so I gotta, I gotta wait before I can run desert again. Please, bro. Oh, okay, Tango. Fine, fine. Maybe I won't. Clicked a random weird video of a tree. Ooh. Do you have an obsession? Probably this game, to be honest. Like, I feel like this is the only game for the last two years I've consistently returned to. Well, almost two years. At the Towards the end of April, it'll be two years. But ever since I started playing this game, nobody's been able to get my attention away from it. Um, so I feel like this game would definitely fall into that category. It said, trees are life, trees are my wife. Oh my gosh. What a strange little video. Has it really been two years? Yeah, Beanie, I started this game in April of 2022. Next month, it'll be two years. It'll be 2024. Beanie, it's been two years since we've seen each other in person. Beanie, it's been two years. That also means we've known each other for almost three. <laughs> it's been two years since we met up, Beanie. Bluey says hi. He's trying to get your shake. Aww. Pet him. I love him. Yep, my favorite horse breed is a thoroughbred. And this chair is fake leather. And it is hot in here. <laughs> Alright, lunar time. Maybe near you this Saturday? Yo! What are you doing on Saturday, if you're able to say? Are you doing? Have you caught the Marwari yet? I haven't. Looking at a house over there? Yo! You are- if- if you start living near me, you are- you are always welcome to come say hi. <laughs> you are- you're always welcome to come say hi. Forgot I haven't even maxed my capture log again. Tango, what, uh, what- what coats do you need? I hope so. Yeah, you are always welcome. My, I would say my- my family loves you, but to be honest, my mom doesn't remember you. <laughs> My my mom actually doesn't remember you. She met you. She said hi to you. She shook hands with your parents. And she doesn't remember any of you. Ooh, the Marwaris? Okay. Yeah. Like, my mom literally shook hands with Beanie's parents. Um, Shook hands with Beanie. 
they all introduced each it, themselves to each other, and then my mom's just like, well, <laughs> no longer in my memory. Yeah, she literally drove us somewhere, too, and she doesn't remember you. Good news, my niece was born. Aw, congrats! Congrats, Sophie! Yeah, she doesn't remember you or your family. It was born on the day you got the IUH Fjord. Yo, Moose shares a birthday. Look at Moose already, already sharing birthdays with people. You go, Moose. She's already very quickly becoming one of my favorite IUHs in my inventory. Moving my cat so I can eat their outside. <gasps> if your cat was sitting with you, that is a crime. Everybody knows that when a cat is sitting with you, you don't move until the cat decides to move. That's the rule of cats. Everybody loves cats. List your favorite horse breeds. Favorite to least favorite. Okay, favorite is Thoroughbred. Followed by Marwari. Followed by Frisian. Um, I need to write these down. Hang on. Let's open my capture log. See all of them. Um, I need to write these down. Uh, I'll rate them later. I'll post like a little, a little tier list later. <laughs> I have three and they want my sub. Well, listen, pet them. Bye, have a good day. That's six little cats. Oh, I love cats. They're so cute. They're always so sweet. I've never met a cat that didn't like me. Cats are meant to be spoiled rotten babies? Exactly! I spoil my cats like crazy. Are you a cat person or a dog person? I'm a cat person. But I also- I love dogs too, I just haven't been around enough of them. Going to a horse sale this week? Ooh! Um, toss a, pe a piece of ham to them. Aww. Sorry, I was scrolling up in chat for something. You're playing with Smiley Cat? Oh, it's Smiley! I love her. She has the prettiest eyes I've ever seen. Alright, I think, I think after I catch this last horse, I'm, I'm gonna run the islands that I've, I've captured on. I'm not gonna catch anything. I'm not gonna catch anything unless it's something we need. Um, and then I'll probably end up ending. So give me a minute to stand up. This is the last question period where I stand up. So I'm going to stand up. You guys feel free to ask any question you want. And then we'll do the last run of the islands I've been searching. So ranch, do your little dance. There we go. Alright, I'm going to stand up. Okay, I'm standing. Um, 
You have to play it. Big City Little Kitty. It's so cute. You need to play it. It's not out yet. Okay, I'll look into it. I'll keep an eye on that one. I'll look into it. <sighs> they devoured it? Well, cats love ham. What's your dream IUH event? Um... Ooh. It used to be the Drizzle Quarter Horse, but as we know, I have malt now. Um... Probably a Latte Fjord. Like, maybe a Ruby one. I know one exists, I just don't think it's for trade for anyone. But... That was the one I saw that I fell in love with as soon as I saw it. One of the ones. <laughs> when will Horse Life be fully released? They don't have a release date. Um, they have not given an estimate on when Horse Life will be released. What motivates you to play Wild Horse Island so much? Um, I think it's the... I think it's the collection and trading aspect of it. Like, I've loved this game. I love trading in most games. As you guys have probably seen me in the trading hub, I haven't done a lot of trading in a while. Um, but I think it's the collection. I like the process of working for my stuff and hunting for them. And it's... Uh, I think it really, like, scratches the reward section of my brain. Got a max level winged horse on Horse Life and now I don't want them to delete all data. Yeah, but it's kind of inevitable to make it fair for uh, players that join when the full release happens. <sighs> What's your RUH goal? Um, I want to catch at least 20 on my own. So far I've caught 13. I've kept 11 of them. So I traded away two of the 13 I've caught. So I've got seven more to catch and I'll be at that goal. I would, I would probably also really like to, um, I would probably also really like to catch my very own event, IUH. How many titles do you have since I was gone for a while? I have 81. Yeah, I've seen two IUHs of the new Pastel Appaloosa. I saw a cow print and I saw a zebra print. If you can get an IUH event this event, what would it be? I would want the Icy with uh, Icy Pink Hair. Um, hmm, yeah, somebody's got a cow print pop tart. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't mind an amethyst marwari either. That actually sounds really cute. All right, we have one singular. Hang on, how much inventory we have open? Yeah. One singular inventory slot open. Let's go run the islands. Can you make more horse life videos? Probably. Uh, the issue with horse life videos is I record them really late at night. So that I can be in a public server and I can try and get some better stuff. So it's usually like 3am when I make any horse life videos. Just because by then the amount of people is kind of calmed down. <sighs> I'd like a prismatic of any of the events. Ooh, that's so true. Me too. I wouldn't mind that. We're skipping on this last runaround. We're skipping any horse that isn't an IUH or an event. Oh, butterfly. Oh, I got it. We're good. I want this one over here, too, please. There we go. What time is it for you now? Um, it is 5.46 p.m. Why aren't there butterflies on Royal? There originally were. They uh they made them stop spawning on Royal. 
I wish they still spawned on there, but I understand why they chose to remove them. Alright, and nothing on forest besides some butterflies that we're going to go ahead and grab. If you were able to get any burgundy dapple IUH, what breed and what hair would it be? Um, I would pick a Frisian and I would want it with a moonstone. Yeah, a Frisian with Moonstone, just because it was a beautiful coat. How many butterflies do you have? I can check. Um, I have... Well, that's not what I meant to click. I have 125. Got paper bag and aura for 10k. Oh, My cats are also now begging for more ham. <laughs> I relate. I get that. <sighs> they crave the ham. I crave ham sometimes. I understand. What's your group? Um, my group is Tamaria's Rose Garden. You can find it um, three or four different ways. It's linked in the description. You can use the chat command exclamation point group. Um, I linked it in my most recent community post. Or you could check my Roblox profile and it should be my primary group. They're like ham, 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 but if if it were meows, yeah, fair. Man, I kind of wish Sparky were a little bit more vocal. I I love cats that meow a lot. Just because it's so cute. <laughs> Sparky isn't super vocal. She's a pretty chill cat. She doesn't really ask for a lot. When she begs, she sits there quietly and just waits. She's very patient. Supposed to have an Easter ham, but mom's making chicken instead. Oh, that still sounds so good, though. Welcome back! Yeah, once we get up to Lunar again, I think I'm gonna end. So we just have Desert, Mountain, and Lunar to run. Bluey is vocal. Oh, yeah, I don't know. I like cats that meow a lot. Oh, I love roasted potatoes. My grandma makes uh, roast potatoes sometimes, and they're so addictive. They're they're so the way they're made. They're not like really good for you the way she makes them, but they're so good. They taste so good. She usually serves them with like a bunch of other stuff, and I've been craving them recently. But I don't, I don't know how to make them the way that she makes them. Oh, I hate potatoes. I just, the way that she makes them specifically, they're so good. And I don't know, I feel like every, every attempt I've ever made was just not good enough. The potato show can't be too unhealthy. That's true. But like, I, the way she makes them is so good. I've never been able to replicate it. My grandma is just like a, a god tier cook. She's so good. I'm gonna go thank you for streaming. Bye, Pebbles! Does she use like a tub of butter or something? No, it's the it's the shortening she uses. She uses that, the shortening that, like, comes in, like, those little round containers, like, the size of a, of a coffee can. 
And she doesn't use a ton of it, but like it's still not good for you. Yeah. Do you like sweet potatoes? Mm, no, not really. I've never been a big fan of them. Though, I haven't had them since I was a kid. And I know that my, um, my taste buds have changed a lot. So I really, um, I don't know if I like them. Yeah, so far I've checked I've checked every every spawn point up close in my run so far. Sweet potatoes are meh. That's so real. Is prismatic an IUH color? Yes it is. I don't have a prismatic IUH yet, but yes it is. I've um I've never had baby potatoes. <laughs> Beanie's my favorite now. Okay. Let me do a little animated thing. Thank you. Come on, get up there. Come on, ranch. What's your favorite IUH? Um, neon blue. And if you mean like, uh, one I own, a neon blue paint horse. <laughs> Her name is Mulan. Yeah, Prismatic is an IUH color. It comes from Volcano. Do you like Pinterest? Um, I never really fell into the, the trend of using Pinterest. So I haven't had many experiences. I hop on the site sometimes to look for inspiration, but I, um, yeah. I don't know. Never really used it consistently. What IUH do you want the most that you don't have? Um, it used to be neon purple, but I got one lately. Um, we'll say topaz. Or maybe pink cow print. All right, Ranch, you take a break right there. We're gonna get lit. We're gonna let Ranch just get her stamina back up for a minute. All right, go ahead, Ranch. Isn't that a white Frisian with pink cow print? Yeah, I would love to get one of those. I go. Bye. Thank you for the stream. Bye. I just check kind of like every spawn point. After this, we've just got Lunar to run and then I'm ending. I can get down off of the rocks for a minute. What's your favorite horse that you have? Um, Trident. She's my main title. And just my main horse in general, but tried it. This is fine. Yeah, I'm just starting to get tired. I've been at my desk since, uh, since pretty early this morning. Oh, that did- that horse did a backflip! What? Bro, all that effort to not have fancy hair. Do you have a horse with the same birthday? No, I do not. How long have you had Trident? I feel like it's been a while. 
I have had Trident since I caught her, so since June 19th, 2022. I caught her uh, almost two years ago. In June, it'll be two years. Trident was caught June 19th, 2022 um, on Lunar Island. What about Tidal Trivia? Tidal Trivia is on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. However, this upcoming Monday, so tomorrow, there will not be a stream. So in April 2022, what's your Wild Horse Island birthday? Um, I started Wild Horse Islands on April 22nd, 2022. My first horse that I caught on Tutorial Island was a brown, or it might have been a bay quarter horse. Her name is Jupiter. She was a V1 quarter horse. I still have her. Sorry, I'm back. Mel walked in. What does a V1 quarter horse look like? Oh, I'm so glad you asked. Pull this. Uh, Jupiter is brown. I was right. This is a V1. Oh, no, come back. <laughs> this is a V1 quarter horse. This is the quarter horse. I got her on April 22nd, 2022 on Tutorial Island. Who's your favorite child between Tango and Beanie? Neither of them are children. <laughs> In fact, Beanie's older than I am. Um, Tango, I'm terribly sorry, but if I had to pick between you and Beanie, I am picking Beanie. <laughs> you guys are both very good friends, but I've met Beanie in person. I've known Beanie longer. I would never want to choose between you guys, but I've known Beanie for almost three years now. <laughs> like, both of you guys are really good friends, but... To be honest, Beanie is four hours away from me. There's... <laughs> There's, there's definitely a time difference. We gotta... I'll... I'll, I'll hmm. We pick the people I knew longer, too. Yeah, I don't know. I like hanging out with both of you. I've got no real preference, but... If it came down to, pick one, or you're gonna, like, blow up or something, I'm picking Beanie. <laughs> Because ultimately, if there's one person that could, like, hunt me down, it's Beanie. <laughs> Beanie's only, like, four hours away from my location. It's gonna blow up, exactly, you know? It's, it's not realistic, but it's a good example. <laughs> Oh, yeah, it used to be a, a joke that Beanie was just always around. Like, Beanie was just always in my closet. We don't know how she got there. She's just been there. One day it's not gonna be a joke. Listen, Beanie is the tallest person on my mod- No, never mind. <laughs> Sorry, Beanie, I take that back. Beanie is the second tallest person on my mod team. <laughs> Sorry, Beanie. <laughs> Who 
Who's taller? Xander. <laughs> you and Xander are around the same height, but I'm... You gotta remember, Beanie, I'm a, I'm a firm Beanie is always shorter believer. What does the T stand for on the cup? Tamaria. <laughs> Specifically, Mel made it mean Tam Donalds, but uh, Tamaria. <laughs> yeah, I'm giving I'm giving Xander the the role of tallest because a running joke between Beanie and I is that Beanie is always the second tallest whenever anything happens. So like every time it, it fits my narrative, Beanie gets shorter. <laughs> What are you hunting for right now? The the silly little Marwari. I've been live for almost three hours and um I I found three event horses. Right? Three? No. Yes, three. Okay, yeah, three. Three hours and three event horses. Like to file a complaint? That's too bad. May I talk to your manager? No. Hope you get the Marwari. Thank you. I I really hope so too. Bro is the manager. Real. Bye, see you next stream. Bye, Grace. Hey Tango, come here. <laughs> Come get it, Tango. <laughs> get your new IUHs? No, my newest one was on Wednesday. Time doing the spin when people ask for the manager. Real, I'll just turn around. Be like, I'm here. <laughs> Um, in the meantime, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end. I've been live for about three hours now. We really only found, like, three events. Um, I'll write down how many I find in the time I'm offline. So that when I go live on Tuesday, yeah, when I go live on Tuesday, I'll update the event count as well. Um, so you guys know the drill. When you see the things for watching screen, type title in the chat. I'll see you guys on Tuesday, because I won't be live tomorrow. Um, good morning for now. Oh yeah, also, go check out the, the video I posted last night. Go do it. <laughs>